Today's exercise is going to be uh, mid-back rotation, and we're going to do it on hands and knees. I'm going to use a gorgeous ball to um, put between my knees to anchor my pelvis, and, but you can use anything that's about hip width apart. Uh, so you can use a pillow or whatever, but that squeezing in activation of your inner thigh or your adductor is going to help anchor the pelvis because we tend to really use our low back way more than our mid back for rotation. So we want to kind of stabilize the low back so that that rotation is coming more from the mid back and get that good rotation there. So we're going to come on to all fours, knees underneath hips and hands underneath shoulders. And I want you to, we talked about this in the chin tuck tip video. I want you to suck the tongue up to the roof of your mouth and then draw it back. When you do that, it helps us resist the urge to drop the head down and forward and helps us lengthen and stretch out our neck. So with your pillow or ball or whatever you have in, you're going to squeeze lightly into there to activate the inner thighs. Now with this, you can't see because of my sweatshirt, but I want you to make sure that your shoulder blade isn't winging. So I don't want it popping up away from your scapula or have your scapula or your shoulder blade popping away from the rib cage. I want it nice and flush. So we're going to use that push away, keep the um, shoulder blade nice and anchored to the rib cage. Then I want you to just lift the right hand and touch right back by the shoulder blade and feel if that muscle is stabilizing, keeping you from swaying side to side. Check out the other side, grab back in through here. Feel that muscle turned on, trying to keep a long neck, not letting the shoulders wrench up to the ears. Then take your left hand to the back of the neck. Neck is still long, squeezing in on your ball and you're going to rotate up. So now this is with me locking out my lower back. So I'm not getting much rotation. If we let the knees relax and let the low back get into it, we can get much further, but we want to isolate it to the mid back. So squeeze in on your pillow or ball, right hand to the back of the neck, long neck, extend from the mid back and hold at the top and then come back down, extend up, try five or 10 of these. So it's almost like um, a strengthener rather than a stretch. We're using our muscular strength to get that range of motion. And you can feel the muscles around the shoulder girdle working too. So again, left hand behind the neck, long neck, engage the inner thighs, Rotate, long neck, come down, rotate again. So the movement is small, but we're using the muscles to help get that range of motion rather than relying on the flexibility of our low back. Give it a try and let me know what you think.